All right, guys, I know this is a little different than my normal reviews, but if you've been keeping up with my channel, you know I've been really getting into merino wool. It's an amazing fabric. I've talked about it a lot in previous videos, so I'm not going to get into too much about it. But let's just say it's antimicrobial, antibacterial, doesn't smell, dries quick, and regulates temperature. Amazing. Keeps you warm when it's cold, doesn't keep you too hot when it's hot. So I wanted to talk about this product I have here. But first I'm just going to show this. We've all had these. I've had probably 50 of these in my life. It's those, you know, oil-based synthetic blankets which feel really nice, fleece blankets. They feel really nice for a while, but then after you wash them a few times, they really don't feel good anymore. They're inexpensive. They are great. They work. But they, again, are synthetic. They can start smelling quick. And again, as you wash them, they just kind of wear out. Not so good. <clears throat> I've been trying to get rid of huge amounts of just like extra stuff. Like I had like five of these things. I kept one here. This is actually for my cat now. And I gave away the rest um, because I don't want to have tons and tons of things that I don't need. So now what I got is this. I've had this thing for a couple weeks now and I gotta say it's amazing. I have a TV only in this room. It's actually right where you guys are. You guys are sitting on my TV stand. The camera is. I don't have a TV in my bedroom. I don't see a need for it. But because the TV's here and I got a couch here, I'll quite often be watching a movie and fall asleep here. With that blanket, I'd get too cold or too hot, depending on the temperature. This is a 100% handmade, 100% merino wool uh, throw blanket made in Ireland. Now, again, I don't care much about style. Some people might think this looks like a grandma's towel, I mean a grandma's uh, blanket or something. I think it looks just fine. It's just a nice kind of off-white color. And this thing is 55 by 70, I believe. Let me see if I can see. Yeah, 55 by 70. It's not a huge blanket that you're going to fit two people under very easily. You'll probably be sticking a leg out somewhere. You probably could fit two small people under it. But for one person, this is a great throw for on a couch. And just for demonstration to show it's big enough, I can fit my whole body under this and be laying down. So it's plenty big. And what's awesome about these is they don't smell fast. Again, with the synthetic, uh, I would notice that with my cat sitting on it and such, it could start smelling pretty quick. What I do with this one is if I'm sleeping with it and using it, I keep it here. But when I wake up in the morning, I throw it in my laundry room so my cat's not on it and it's not out in the house. To wash this, all you do is throw it in a sink with some wool soap and cold water. Let it sit there for about a half an hour and swish it around a little bit rinse it off and then just bring it back to your couch and just lay it out flat on your couch you know get it laid out flat on your couch and it'll be dry in a couple hours that's all you do to wash it super simple stays nice and soft I just really love merino wool I've been all my clothes I'm wearing right now are merino wool except for my uh, long sleeve shirt here which is still wool it's cashmere even my socks are merino wool um, so I just really love this fabric and this blanket, a little expensive again, instead of having 10 of these cheap blankets that I just threw over there, this one I'm just going to take care of and it's just the only one I need. Now I do have two more of those cheap blankets in my car, so if I had friends over that needed a blanket or something, I do have a couple extras for that purpose, but they're just wrapped up in my car. So. Anyways, wanted to throw that out there. I'll put a link in the description. This didn't have a brand name. I just found it randomly. There weren't many reviews on it. I was the second review on it. Um, but supposedly it's handmade in uh, Italy. Or no, no, no. Ireland. And uh, it's just really great. I, I really like it so far. It's a little different style review for me again, like I said. But check it out. If you get into Merino wool, it's another great Merino wool product. So I'll show it up close real quick here again so you can see it, then we'll end the video.